Welcome to Moving Math and Science. In this video, let's take a look at the rules of positive and negative signs in math. I have a couple of simple rules that I think if you learn, will make learning these rules much easier. So let's get started. Up first is multiplication and division. The same rules apply to both. Rule one, if you have same signs, the answer is always positive. Let's look at a couple examples. You have 4 times 3, it's going to be 12. Now you have negative 2 times negative 3. It's going to be positive 6. Let's look at division. Positive 6 divided by positive 3 equals positive 2. And then a negative 2 divided by a negative, excuse me, a negative 10 divided by a negative 2 equals a positive 5. Now, the next rules for multiplication and division. Different signs are always negative. 4 times negative 3 equals negative 12. 4 divided by negative 2 equals negative 2. Now let's go over addition. Okay, first, same signs. You add and keep the sign. Pretty straightforward. 4 plus 4 equals 8. Negative 4 plus negative 4 equals negative 8. Again, you add and keep the sign. Now, different signs. You subtract, then keep the sign of the larger number. So, we have 6 plus a negative 2. That's going to be 4. You subtract, and 6 is larger than 2, so it will be positive. Now, negative 6 plus 3 equals a negative 3. It becomes negative because the absolute value of 6 is greater than the absolute value of 3. If this confuses you, just drop the sign and see which number is larger. Now let's move on to subtraction. When you subtract, you keep the sign of the larger number. An example, 10 minus 3 equals 7. 10 is larger than 3, so the answer will be positive. 3 minus 10 equals negative 7. 10 is larger than 3, technically you know the absolute value, so the answer will be negative. And here's the last rule. What do you do with this? 4 minus a negative 8. You are taking a negative of a negative, so it becomes a positive. So a simple shortcut is when you're subtracting a negative number, just change it to positive. So it becomes 4 plus 8 equals 12. 6 minus a negative 2 becomes 6 plus 2, which equals 8. 3 minus a negative 9 becomes 3 plus 9, which equals 12. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.